बिस्मिल्लाम रबी यसर वलात वसर वतमिन बिल रब नरमा असल ओपियोल और गुड दिस इज़ दी डी थ्री अपडेटेड सेवन्थ एडिशन एंड टुडे वी विल डू एक्सरसाइज ट्वेल्व बी एंड लेट स्टार्ट स्टूडेंट्स नाउ स्टूडेंट्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन ऑन अ शीट ऑफ अ पेपर इन लार्ज द फॉलोइंग फिगर विद सेंटर ऑफ इलमार्जन मी एंड स्केल फैक्टर ईच इंडिकेटेड इन ब्रैकेट now we have to enlarge these figures these are figures in provided in the question number 1 and there is not any scale for these figures and i draw randomly from your from the book and because there is no scale only the a center of enlargement is given to us and there is a concept how we enlarge the figure how we make the enlargement of any figure and in this figure there is also not any naming a b c d so we have to only enlarge these figures and the simple method how we have to enlarge these figures we now for transforming the image first we have to draw the lines like that first corner the line passing from first corner the second corner and the third and the fourth corner now students we have to enlarge the figure in this area that is the area which we defined by drawing this line now we measure the point and this is the now we have to measure it it is uh, 4.1 and now we have to open the compass 8.2 8.2 we have to place it place that point and mark that point and we have to the center of enlargement is given to us first we have to measure that this is 4.2 mine and i have to double it and it is 8.2 now we have to measure that point you can measure it directly with scale also it is 5.1 and now i am opening the compass 10.2 you can see there this is 10.2 place it at that place place at the point e which is the center of and mark that point this is one point second point now the third one we have to measure it first now students i am measuring the third point and it is equal to approximately 2.6 this is 5.2 and place it at that point and mark that point the third point of enlargement and the fourth point of enlargement is uh, 4.2 and this is equal to 8.4 now i am opening the compass 8.4 this is 8.4 now join this point this is the enlargement of this figure and now students the part number a is solved the part number 2 the part number 2 figure has three points now this is the center of enlargement this is the area in which we have to draw the enlargement of this figure and we have to measure that line point 2 the in the first part number a i draw the figure with the help of the compasses 
draw the enlargement with the help of the compasses is basic method is that we have to draw the enlargement with the help of the compasses but we can do it with a scale also now i am drawing this uh, enlargement with the help of the scale and this is equal to 3.2 3.2 is multiplied by 2 we get 6.4 and I am marking the point, uh, the 6.4 on that line, this one. And this point is uh, 3 point, uh, 3.4. And now I am marking the point, uh, 3.4 is multiplied by 2, get 6.8. This is a 6.8. Now, students, so say the 2.2. Now, students, so the from the third point, the distance is 2.2, and this is the 4.4 enlargement. Is this is 4.4, and now I am matching this point. This is the enlargement of this figure. And now students, the part number 2B is solved. Now students, we have to measure the distance from the center of enlargement. And this is the 2. We multiply the, the A3. We multiply the 2 by 3. We get 2, 6. And we have to mark the point at 6 centimeter. This is 6 centimeter. This is the point. And this point is 2.8. 2.8 is multiplied by 3. We multiply by 8, we get 8.4. And now we have to mark it 8.4. This is 8 and 4. And this is a point 8.4. From that, this is 2. And 2 multiply by 3, we get 6. And this is a point 6. And this is 2.8 and 8.4. This point. And this one, this one, this one. Now the distance is 1.4, uh, 1 1.4 1 is multiplied by 3, we get 4.2, this is 4.2 and this is 2 and 2 multiplied by 3 we get 6, this is 6. Now we have to match this point. Now since this is the enlargement of this figure, the center of enlargement is 3 and uh, the part number C is done. Now, since this is a part number D, now first we have to define the area in which the figure is enlarged. Now, since this is the area, we have to measure that and this is equal to 3. 3 multiplied by 3, we get uh, 9. And that area is 9. The enlargement of this point is there. And this is equal to 5. 5 multiplied by 3 we get 15. And so we have to mark the point 15 there. This one is 15. And this point is again 3. And this is 
now we match this point now students this is the enlargement of this figure with scale factor 3 and now students see part number D is done now students see part number E there are the three points first we have to define the area in which the figure will be enlarged the second line is this one and the third one is this one first we have to measure it this is equal to 3.6 3.6 uh, 6. 6 I multiply by 3.6 I multiply by 1.5 one whole and 1 by 2 is equal to 1.5 that's why I multiply it by 1.5 and we get 5.4 and this one is equal to 5.4 this point the figure is from that point and this is the enlarge the area where it's transformed where the where this enlargement of this point is transformed and this is from the center of area is uh, six now i multiply the six by 1.5 and get nine and this is that point nine and the center is uh, 3.5 3.5 is multiplied by 1.5 3.5 multiplied by 1.5 we get 5.25 which this is 1.25 this is the center is yes. that distance from the center of enlargement is uh, 3 and 3 is multiplied by 1.5 3 multiplied by 1. we get 4.5 and this is 4.5 now match this point this is the enlargement of this figure and uh, one thing you have to one thing I want to clear to you that the points I take randomly because there is no scale given in your book. I draw the uh, these figures and now I do this measurement and there is not any scale uh, from which I draw the figure. I only draw the figure, copy the figure from your book and uh, I make the enlargement of these figures. Which scale comes? I note measuring from the book because there are too little in your books and it is very difficult to draw uh, to show you the measurement that is only the concept in this question how to enlarge the figure now students see part number f and this is first we have to area there is five points one two three four and this middle one is fifth one in this area the figure will be enlarged and uh, first we measure this uh, distance from that point this is 2.5 2.5 the center of enlargement is 1.5 one whole 1 by 5 is equal to 1.5 i multiplied uh, this uh, 2.5 with 
2.5 multiply by 1.5 we get 3.75 3.7 and this is the point 3.56 and 7 now the point from this is now since this point is equal to this point uh, from that distance is a uh, 3.6 and 7, 3.7, 3.7 is multiplied by 3, 1.5, 3.7 is multiplied by 1.5 and we get 5.5 and that distance is 5.5. This is the point and this distance is equal to 3.2. 3.7 again this is the 5.5 this one now since so these two points are left now students so I am adding that distance this is equal to 5 point this is equal to 5.2 5.2 multiply by 1.5 and we get 7.8 7.5678 this is equal to 7.8 and this distance is also equal to and this side is also equal to 5.2 now we have to draw the 5 7.8 this is 7.8 now we match this point this is a straight line and from that point this is and that is the enlargement of our figure now so this question is only concept based how we enlarge the how we transfer the figure uh, with enlargement and uh, the question number one is done. I hope you understand this concept very well. Thank you very much students for watching my videos. Take care of yourself. Allah Hafiz.